I have been a recreation specialist at the Boscoyaki tribe for five and a half years. I am around kids all the time. Our young people hold us to high standards. I often hear them say, my mom does this, my dad does that. Our future is watching all we do, good, bad, everything. In the beginning, I didn't think tobacco was such a big deal. It probably speaks to how acceptable it is in our community and how we use cigarettes within ceremonies. When I returned from the tobacco intervention training in the spring of 2013, I began asking our kids in our after-school program and summer programs what they knew about smoking. We'd tell them the negative effects and encourage our kids by saying, I hope none of you smoke. Weeks after the training, I began noticing all the signs around our buildings. I remember people saying we weren't supposed to smoke at the parks or at the centers. It seemed like there was always a rule about no smoking, but now it was being enforced. That is when everything clicked for me. I thought, wow, it's really a big deal. As role models, we must ask ourselves, who's watching us? Do we want our community to see us through a cloud of smoke? Do we want our kids to see, say, or do things we don't really mean? Our children follow us, at times even on an unconscious level. Let's stay on the right path and arrange our lives in a way that will make our community healthy and well. I have learned that I am a role model to many youth in my life, family, friends, and community. I notice that people watch me, watch us, all the time. If I poison myself with something like tobacco, the youth, my youth, our youth will see me, will see us. Ask yourself, who's watching me?